Hey DVG fam, this is a video I didn't think I'd ever have to make but Sarah's left us, she's had enough. I think she said that I was just too funny, that she couldn't live with me anymore because I was so hilarious that she was just laughing all the time and her stomach constantly hurting from just laughing so much and she just couldn't handle it so she's leaving us. She's packed her bags, she's sitting in the car outside so let's go and see what she's got to say for herself. That's it guys, had enough, over and out, done. She's got people. Jokes. You could never I'm leave joking. us. I'm joking, I'd never leave you guys. I mean you are technically leaving us. I am leaving you, but only for two, oh potholes, seriously. Oops, didn't see them. Yeah, but only for a weekend. Um, so my, my best friend is actually getting married in Ireland. Well, I was your best friend. You are my bestest, bestest friend. That Why is true. Why did you keep calling her your best friend? My girl best friend. Yeah! Okay. Look, you've done tire pressure now. Listen, I don't put the potholes there. I just, oh my god. I just use them. Tire pressure's low. If you've just punctured your tire by tire on the way to the airport. Oh god, I was sad that she was leaving and now I'm not. I remembered that actually. No, I'm joking. No, I'm not joking. You need to play over and check the tires, okay? Of course it's going to be fine. But then why does it come up that it's low pressure? It says stop carefully, look, low pressure. Oh gosh. Let's make it like this. It's the back. It's, it's, seriously, his driving skills are not great. I'm not joking, it's actually flat. Alright, so I've literally just punctured the tire. You can't be cross with me. I didn't put the pothole no, there. No, you didn't put the pothole there, but you never look at a pothole, ever. No, I am cross with you because you've done that to my car and I'm now late. Sarah is now having to order an Uber. See, imagine if you could it and you wasn't even going to check. I'm like, oh. just check because imagine if you, you feel bad, don't you? I don't feel bad. You I feel do. bad for myself. I just feel bad for like, poor me. Having to listen to this abuse. No. Seriously. That's not my fault. It was your fault. I've never seen the pothole before. Yes. I didn't notice that. I don't know where every pothole is, Joel, but I look where I'm driving so that that doesn't happen. Okay, so the world's quickest changeover. Ah, no problems. There is problems. Quick, come on. Free. Got 20 minutes to get there. I don't know if we've got enough batteries to get there and back. As I was saying before the idiot drove through the pothole. So my friend is getting married in Ireland, um, which we are going to, but it's not until July. Um, I'm going with her to just finish some final plans and she's having a makeup trial. Um, so yeah, so I'm flying with her to do a little bit of wedding prep, which is all exciting. So Joel was left behind with the girls. All weekend by myself. Okay. All weekend. Again. So yeah, I've got the girls all weekend. Grace has actually gone skiing with the school trip, but she comes back today, so I've got to pick her up. Which I'm actually yeah. really sad that I don't get to see her. I like get I've, to see Grace. I, give she's her been a away. Big cuddle. I like you, I haven't seen her for a whole week, and I, I feel like it's the longest I haven't seen her. I feel like yeah. we, we've been away a couple of days, but never like a whole week apart. So I actually really, really miss her. She's been sending lots of pictures and videos, and um, she'll probably tell you all the stuff that she's done when she picks her up. But her and her friends bought a piercing gun, and she pierced one of her friends' ears. Like, is that them? Right. They've had a great time. Girls, yeah. How do you feel about yeah. mommy going on the aeroplane today? Really good. Really good. Are you sad. gonna sad? Why are you sad? I just don't want you to go. Oh, sorry. Should I buy you? Actually, happy. Are you happy? Yeah, because I was sleeping in mummy dad's. Oh. <laughs> We're going to have a fun weekend, aren't we, guys? Yeah? Oh. No? We made it. What time just is about. it? 12 minutes. We're 12 minutes late, but that is okay. That's pretty impressive for uh, getting a flat tire only being 12 minutes late. That is. That is actually very good. I love oh. you guys. Love you. Oh, yeah. oh, love you. Sophie's gonna start crying, so I'm not gonna make a big fuss. I'm okay. gonna go and hug them all, but she's already getting upset, okay? Okay. Oh, look at her cute little suitcase. All right, love you. Have a great time, bye. So we just pulled up at home. Fanny <laughs> Moose is asleep. Bless her. So we weren't gonna go out for breakfast, but then uh, Chloe and Sophie said they don't wanna go because they've actually eaten breakfast. They had croissants in the car, I didn't realize. So um, I don't know what to do, because if I get Maddie out of the car seat, she's gonna wake up. Should we stay in the car for a few minutes and no. let her sleep? 
Should we try and sneak her into bed? Shh, she's waking up, she's waking up. Sophie. Uh-oh, someone is wide awake. You're not gonna go back home for a nap, are you? You're not, are you? Yeah, she's trying to escape from your cuddles, isn't she? <laughs> Where's that Maddie Moose? The Maddie's just been eating her breakfast. And she's already made a mess. Did you make a mess? What do you want to show me? Oh, Maddie. Oh my god. Mommy said not to eat one I know she did. We literally had these sofas professionally clean yesterday. That's why all the sofas are up like this. I didn't realise Maddie's brought her breakfast in here. Look, it's literally milk. It's not going well already. We've only been home five minutes. Madison, Daddy's got to tell you off now, okay? Yeah. Look at me, take me seriously. Madison. <laughs> It's not laughing because I'm being serious. I'm feeling very good. Cool. Madison, you are naughty. This is Madison. Madison, I'm cross with you. This is naughty behaviour. You're gonna have to go. On. Should we put it on the naughty step? Yes. Do you think we should? Right, Madison. For the first time ever, you are going on the naughty step. Let's see if she stays. Come on. Come on. <laughs> right, five minutes time out, okay? <laughs> Starting from now. Oh, look, she's actually standing. Oh, no, she's not. Okay, listen, Maddie, I think you've learnt your lesson. Your five minutes is up. I can see you're really sorry. Daddy needs to clean the sofa. I want to see. I hope, I hope Sarah doesn't watch this vlog because otherwise I'm going to be in big trouble. This weekend, I've done everything this morning except for the dishwasher needed redoing and the bins and obviously make sure the girls don't eat in the front room because the sofa's just been cleaned um okay perfect yeah i'll make sure they don't okay all right mean it. no yeah good. all good all good i'm on it all right love you have a good time call me when you get there love you bye maddie seems very tired so we're gonna try and put her for a nap but I'm not sure it's gonna work because she already had a little nap in the car. Do you wanna go to bed? Go to sleep, okay? <laughs> so after about five minutes of crying, she is fast asleep. What should we do today? Mummy said we have to go to Emily's house. Oh, well, we're going to a part birthday party, aren't we? Yeah, to Emily's house. And we need to also pick up Grace today. Yeah, she coming. Yeah, she might come. And should we go and get some lunch? Should we go out for lunch? It's go lunch there because they're going to have lunch there. No, I think we have to eat lunch before the party. Don't think they're going to have lunch. Maybe it's snack. What's Daddy's new rule today? No, Daddy always he would take it off forever and I'm not allowed anything else. So you've probably seen in some of our videos that Chloe and Sophie have a dummy in their mouth and that is because they always, always steal Madison's dummy. It's a constant battle every day. They steal it, we take it back. Some days I just don't bother, I give up. But now we're trying to be strict. So I said today, if I see Chloe or Sophie with a dummy in their mouth, I'm gonna take their phone, their iPad off them for the whole entire day. I hope that was not in your mouth. It was. And Chloe, I hope this one wasn't in your mouth. I mean it, if I see these in your mouth, I'm taking that phone, okay? No, I'm not going to put it there. Why am I going to put it there? Why do you need to know? Are you going to put it up there saying what? Yeah, why do you need to know where I'm going to put it? I'll tell you where I'm going to put it. I want to put it up here. Oh, I can just climb Yeah, up. you can. You can climb up, but what will happen? I'm... No phone, no iPad, nothing. Oh no, Coco's fallen. I know you have actually fallen, but are you stuck under the chair? Yeah, that was my first step. Oh no, Coco's had a major accident and, and she's stuck it. under this chair. What a disaster. You're free. That's amazing. I did it. Well done. I'm bored. What should we do for fun? Hide and seek, and when you find us, yeah. you, 
you can try and take a horse and someone and you have to run and I have to run that way and you can't change weight. Sounds very specific. Okay, I'll go in the utility room. I'm going to count, okay? Twenty-three. Oh, okay. Very specific. No, there's not twenty-three. There's only twenty-four. One, two, three. Okay, ready or not, here I come. Here I come. Bruh. Sophie, are you hiding? Yeah. Are you playing the game? Yeah. Or are you just hiding from us because you don't want to see us? I hope she's not under here. Ready? Let's find out. Squish. Squish. No. I wonder if she's under here. I can't see. I'm going to put the camera under, but I can't actually see. The camera might be able to see if she's in there. <laughs> I'm not sure. Alright, let's give it a little squish. Squish, squish. Let's give this a little squ Oh, it feels a bit squishy. It feels a bit squishy. It feels a bit squishy. Now I'm going to have to tickle you. Now I'm going to have to... You have to let me have five minutes. Five minutes to run away? Yeah. Okay, here I come. Here I come. <laughs> Got ya. Okay, now I'm going to tickle you. <laughs> Sophie's playing now, okay? I'm going to count. Ready? Go. But they're only hiding in the soft play, so it's not exactly going to be difficult, is it? I'm going to see if I can sneak in. Sophie, that is such a rubbish hiding place. I can literally see you. I can see you before I even come in. Right, now I have to find Coco. Okay, let's have a look. <laughs> Sophie's really laughing. Is she in there? Is she in the balls? No. No? Wait, where actually is she? She's not round there. I'm actually really confused because there's not a lot of places to hide in there. Did she sneak out when I wasn't looking? What? What? <laughs> Chloe! Oh my god! I was never gonna find you up there. Katie is up and awake and she is coming for lunch with us. Woohoo! But uh, I think the baby's played. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Okay, if you lose, you're changing the baby's bum. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. You lose, you're changing that butt. You've not got a key to get back in the house. Oh my god, I've just locked us out. Oh, for goodness sake. Oh, that's so annoying. I've just locked us out of the house. What an absolute idiot. I can't believe I've done that. You definitely don't have your key. No, why would I have one? Oh. I don't know what we're going to do. Very good to go. I'm meant to be going out later as well. We're good to go. The only person I can think of who might have a spare key for our house is Sarah's mum and dad. I've just tried to call them, they're not answering. I have no idea where they are today, so I don't know. <laughs> Hopefully they have a key and they answer. We're gonna go for lunch. We're not gonna worry about it. And we're gonna just hope that we speak to Sarah's mum and dad and they have a key. So you're going out tonight? You're not gonna stay home for a little movie night with me and your little sisters? No. We might get in a hot tub. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> it's a party! So we just sat down at our table, but it took us a while to get seated. And we actually have only one hour until we have to pick up Grace. So this is going to be really tight. And we might be a little bit late. We're late. Grace. I hope no one has a dummy. What's in your hands? What's in your hands? Let me see your hands. I did. You want to see something cute, guys? Watch this. She's so cute. Look. Ready? Oh, careful. Careful. Why does she look so cute when she drinks from a straw? Okay, our food has all arrived. I've got chicken salad. What'd you get, Case? Avocado and toasted egg and bread. They all got scrambled egg and some sausage. And I don't think Maddie's going to eat hers. Are you going to eat it? Good girl. Nope. Nope. Maddie, you 
You don't need to feed Sophie. Oh, amazing. She's eating one baked beans. Has she got it? Maddie's just got baked beans all in Sophie's hair. Right, we need to go. I'm not bringing you out to restaurants anymore. Oh I don't even know why I bother going out to eat when Maddie is at the age that she's at. Because it is not enjoyable at all. Look at my stomach from where I'm peeling. Oh my god. You're like a lizard. What the hell? Do you know what I just realised though? What? There's no room for Grace in the car and you can't drop me home either because you haven't got the key. Oh. <laughs> I didn't even think about it. I'm literally like, we're going to go pick up Grace. Where's Grace going to sit? <laughs> right, we're well, going to well, try we Nan and Granddad again. Yeah. We've got half an hour until Grace gets there. Well, you might have to sit outside the house on the doorstep. Absolutely not. No, what we could do is. So we're back home. Sarah's mum and dad are coming over here with a key. Yay! Yay. So we just have to wait. Chloe is currently on the naughty step because she was trying to punch and kick her sister Casey. And Casey snitched on her. Because I said to her, I went, I swear to God, you better stop punching me. And she didn't. And so she's having a time out. Sit down, please. I, oh, you've got a dummy in. Please, can we stop with the dummies? Uh, I don't want to have to tell you guys off. I'm sitting now. You are being good. Well done. Can I come off? Do you want to come and say sorry to Casey? Sorry, Casey. Oh, that's heartfelt. Oh, mummy's calling me. Hello? Hey. Hey, you all right? Yeah, I'm just checking you remember Grace, because it's half two. Uh, yeah, yeah, Grace, um, she messaged me. But the only problem is, um, I locked us all out of the house, so. Right, bye guys. Bye. Oh, you're bye. going. Bye. Casey bye. wants to come with me. You got Jay. Sorry, I'm <laughs> you, you got stitched right up, didn't you? <laughs> right, see you in a minute. Everyone's going to be with their families, and she's going to have... Oh, thanks. Well, when See, we dropped her off, uh, we were the last parents there just waving the coach off. So, you know, like... We yeah, but like, when I got picked up, like, I literally pulled up and, like, saw you guys just standing there waiting. Poor Grace. She's I wonder out, what... that one kid that's just sitting there. Okay, we've just got here and the coaches are there. They look like they've just pulled up. Oh, no, actually, everyone's getting off. Oh, Lord. Yeah, it's Grace. Probably crying. All right, so we've got Grace. Everybody's She's just been on a... Almost 24 hour, no, coach. 15 hour coach journey. So she's uh, like very tired and she doesn't want to be on, <laughs> she be on camera. Chocolate milk downer. I'm not going to lie, she does look pretty rough. Yeah, it looks so rough. <laughs> but Grace, did you have a good time? Yeah, it was really good. It was really, really good. We missed you. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, it was so good. You having fun there, Nan? Come on. Show us how fast you can go, Nan. Come on. Ready? Ready? Go. <laughs> so Sophie and Chloe have a birthday party now and obviously I'm going to take Maddie as well. So we're going to go there for about an hour and a half-ish. And we're not going to vlog there because there's other kids there but we will be back in a minute. And if you're wondering what that rustling sound is, it's because Maddie is trying to open a whole pack of Jeffa cake. Yeah! We are home from the party and the house is a tip and the kids are dirty and messy and everyone is grubby, so I mean, what I'm going to do is bath Maddie and get her into bed soon because she's very, very tired. Oh my lord. Honestly, why does this kid just want to ruin the sofa when it's just been cleaned? People always ask us, who's your favourite kid? And this is why I think Maddie might be Sarah's favourite child. She loves cleaning up. She literally is the tidiest little baby we've ever had. So everyone in the house, when they get home, they just take their shoes off, chuck them wherever. And Sarah always likes the shoes to be put away. Maddie always puts her shoes away and even put my shoes away and the other girl's shoes away. Like, I think she's gonna be a bit like Sarah. She's gonna be like tidy and clean, unlike the rest of us. So, I wouldn't be surprised if Maddie is Sarah's favorite. Oh, and if you're wondering who my favorite is, obviously I don't have a favorite because I don't like any of these kids. Obviously that was a joke. Oh, careful. It's stuck on your head. It's stuck on your head, wait. Maddie. Maddie Moose. Yeah. You are too cute. Yeah. 
Ye ye ye. Hey ye ye. Look at this little clean baby. Look how cute she is. Who's that? Who's that? People say that you look like me. Poor girl. Do you look like daddy? Do you look like daddy? Okay, so Maddie's having an absolute meltdown. I have no idea why. This is really not like her. She won't let me put her down, so. So it's really not like her, so. I'm just gonna sit here with her for a little bit. I think she's gonna go to sleep. Okay, so Maddie moves is asleep. So I'm gonna get her into bed and then have a think about what I'm gonna do for dinner for Sophie and Chloe. This looks like the worst dinner ever, but this is actually what the kids asked for. So Sophie asked for tuna pasta, which she absolutely loves. That's Chloe. What, I said. what? You didn't say tuna pasta. Can Sophie have tuna pasta? Oh, you said Sophie wants tuna pasta. But what do you want? Oh, perfect. You worried me then. I thought I'd done the wrong thing. This isn't me being a rubbish dad making them this food. This is genuinely what they wanted for dinner. What? I did not order plain pasta. No, I didn't take you plain pasta. I've done you tuna pasta. I did not order a plain pasta. This isn't a restaurant, guys, clearly. Yay. There you go, my love. Yeah. Can I get you anything else? Can I please get some ketchup? Oh, yes, yeah, sure. Can you put ketchup on it? Please? I'll bring it over for you right away. Okay, and uh, did anyone order a tuna pasta? Okay, here you go. There's your tuna pasta. Okay, here we go. Oh, sorry, that's your water. That's your cup. Casey has gone out to her friends. Grace is chilling upstairs, just went and checked on her. She is absolutely exhausted. She's done a whole week of skiing. Plus she's done that long coach ride, so she's just chilling up in her room. I'm gonna do me and Grace dinner a little bit later. Just want to get them sorted so then we can get them into bed. I want dinner so we can get ready for bed. But I, I don't have any dinner. I want to. The problem I have when I have the kids and Sarah's away is I cannot stay on top of the house. It is an absolute tip. Like, just everywhere is mess. Even down to just like cupboard doors open, just random stuff everywhere, like shoes and stuff. Like. I don't know, this is what stresses me out because I'm such a messy person. It's part of my ADHD. It's like, I don't know, it's just, I can't stay on top of the house and then it all just gets a little bit too much. So once the kids are in bed, then I'm gonna tidy everything. Can we see if there's ice dolly? Yeah, right, let's have a look and see. No ice I need to go and get ice cream. You want ice cream? Yeah. Yeah? What one do you want? Oh my God, there's so much ice cream in there. What Bye -bye. one do you want? Weirdly, I don't have rainbow ice cream in there. That's so strange. I got your ice cream, but I also got another little treat. What? I thought we could do roasted marshmallows on the fire. Yeah! Yeah, what Yeah! And chocolate. I'll go get my box on, what? Oh, what you got? Oh, you got a blanket. That's a good idea. All right, so here we got the fire. We need to be really careful, okay? Don't stop the marshmallows until Sophie comes. <laughs> oh, that's so nice of you. What a good sister. I wasn't going to start, I was just opening them. Sophie's coming back from the toilet now. Grace has come to join us for marshmallows. And You're looking much better now, Grace. You look, fr you look really fresh. Still. No, you look really on. good. Here she comes. Here she comes. Can I start the marshmallow? Can I have Yeah, so what, all I could find was this. What Ice I was thinking. Oh, yeah. thanks. What I was thinking is if, do it like this. So you do two, yeah? Yeah. yeah. All right. And then, oh, that's not a good idea. And then you can roast these ones, and then Sophie can have a turn after, yeah? You got them? I'm doing it. Remember I went to, and then we did marshmallows. Yeah. You're you're an expert, aren't you? Yeah. 
Oh, that one's on fire. Okay. Yeah, they're not vegetarian, so guys can't eat them. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, you want to cook them more, or are they done? I like them. You like them like that? Yeah. Okay, here's a fork. I'm going to do more. Who's tapping me? Who's hey. tapping me? You want to go? I'm not going to. <laughs> Was you tapping me? Yeah. Okay, hold it then. Well done. I'm already finished. You ate them already? That was so yeah. quick. Maybe you don't turn it. Leave it in for a bit. You want me to do it? I can easily do it all myself. You are doing a great job. Oh, oh! I'm sorry. That's all right, Sophie. You don't have to be sorry. Here you go. Let's put them on. Don't touch them because they are hot. How are they? Um. So good. I can't eat them. Why? Because um, I don't like them. It's my turn. It's your turn. I think I could do it better. I always. <laughs> you think you could do it better? I think you could do it great. Right, guys, it is bedtime now. No, it's so late, it's half I'm nine. Good girl, Chloe. I want to watch a movie too. No, you've been on your phone a lot today. So, 10 minutes. That, no, not 10 minutes. Come on, let's go up. Chloe. Chloe. Dummy. No, just walk one day and give it back to my please. Please. Just for today and give it back to mom. Give it back to mom. And then no more dummy. No. At all tomorrow. No. Are you gonna go straight to sleep and be a good girl? Yeah. Okay, don't tell mommy though. Okay. Pinky promise. Oh look at this picture. Look at me Pinky and Coco promise. on the ride. I love that picture of me and you. That's cute. I wanna go there again. Come on guys, let's go brush teeth. Come on. Alright, I'm gonna put the camera down while we brush teeth. Okay, all the kids are asleep. I just need to tidy up this house. Then I need to make me and Grace dinner. It's actually really late. Normally wouldn't eat this late. Uh, and I've got one more day to entertain the kids tomorrow and then Sarah's back on Monday and hopefully everything will be fine. Guys, if you haven't already, then please subscribe to the channel and I will see you on the next vlog.